I've been with Balanced Do for about seven years now. And I can hardly remember what it was like before. I do remember that I was in great pain, had been in great pain. Uh, I called it psychic pain most of my life. And just on listening to the first video, that loosened. I mean, I really could feel the opening and the relief and the subtleness of it. I also remember something really wonderful because my whole life had been in kind of spiritual practices from a small child that I didn't have to do anything. I didn't have to change in any way and I didn't have to try to do anything. I didn't have to understand anything. It, it was amazing to me. This was the first practice, and then I, I just have to say I had uh, maybe 30 years of steeped in a Christian tradition, even professionally, and then about 30 years in a Zen Buddhist practice. So in those, I, knew, I could see... I didn't know this right away, but it soon became very obvious that everything that I had learned and practiced up until the time I met Balanced View was an intellectual exercise and that I, by not doing anything, by following the Four Mainstays, which is this incredible support system, I could just relax into every moment and directly experience, directly be, not do, not think about, but directly be without trying to love, compassionate, beneficial, it was all of the things that I had learned about, I actually became. And this is, I think, due to the direct, this incredible teaching is so direct and so simple. I mean, just down to the very basic of our minds are open intelligence and data. Just that basic, down to that basic, that... The data is everything, all phenomena, everything I think, everything I feel, everything I do, every situation, every person, every place, everything, all of that, all the, like the content of my mind is data. And then the incredible energy and power to know that that is rests in is open intelligence. And I, just the simplicity of that was... Beautiful. I mean, exquisitely beautiful. And um, the Four Mainstays, um, a Short Moments, of course, which are incredible instruction that I could do anytime, anywhere, wherever I was without changing. I didn't have to go sit on the cushion. I really thought, um, I had noticed that the people that were able to really know who they were and what their mind was in my Zen practice were those that went to Korea. I was in a Korea style. Went to Korea and became a nun or a monk for seven years. For some reason, I saw four or five people around me that it was about a seven-year process of completely leaving life and doing that. Those people were able to, in my experience of them, know who they were. I didn't have to do that. <laughs> I can take a short moment anytime, anywhere. And then the text, these beautiful teachings that we have from our, our, from our, our root trainer, our founder, Candace, just, they go beyond understanding. And it is just complete... Uh, complete life, you know, food, life. 
<laughs> they are completely transmitted in a way that I don't have to try to understand or even understand at all. And then the, another mainstay is our trainer. Each one of us get a personal trainer um, to, to, that we can call on 24 hours a day, seven days a week, all the time to help us when the data gets too strong. And, of course, our root trainer, the, uh, the very basis of all the trainings that we've all received and that our trainers have received, who also has a trainer. Everyone has a trainer. We're all in the same place. We're all doing the same thing. Even the most experienced trainers, the most inexperienced of us, even our root trainer. And then we have this incredible community. This is all over the world. For the first whole year, I only knew people online. And the second year, I went to India to our center there. And Adam was actually the first, <laughs> one of the first people I, I saw. And, um, and then I started getting to know people. But it was incredible. I mean, today, being on calls with people from Australia, England, Europe, <laughs> Chile, all over the world, we have this incredible community that we don't even have to be in the same room, but it is really wonderful being here with you and that we can come together like this once in a while and um, be together indivisibly and eat together. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much for being here.